is Superman. It's coming up pretty soon. I don't know when, but everyone is talking about it. So, they are friends, they are enemies, they fight each other. So I decided to make a video uh, about the most famous rivalries in comics. And with rivalries I mean people that are friends and then enemies and then friends and then enemies. So, let's start now. First, we're going to acknowledge the one that is in the movie already, Batman and Superman. One is a god, one is a millionaire, and you will say, okay, so why are they fighting if they are friends? Well, they have fought many times in comics, and every time is for a different reason. Batman has won, Superman has won, Poison Ivy was involved in one, in the other one, Batman just developed a plan to beat everyone in the Justice League, and then you have the Dark Knight series. Frank Miller just loved to put them fighting each other. Next one, Hal Jordan and Sinestro. They started as the Master and the Apprentice. They were good friends. Sinestro was the best Green Lantern and Hal Jordan was the first human in the Green Lantern Corps. Sinestro trained Hal Jordan and then Sinestro went and got all greedy. He wanted to control the planet by fear. He got kicked out of the Corps. He found the Sinestro Corps, the Yellow Lanterns. Then he went back to the Green Lanterns. Then he went back to the Yellow Lanterns. But at the end of the day, they are friends. So. Next one, Punisher versus everyone. He's just an angry guy. He got his family killed and he decided that he was going to take no prisoners. He's one of the only good guys that is not afraid to kill. He's going to deal with criminals the permanent way. And because of that, he has fought a lot of superheroes. He was first introduced in Spider-Man as an enemy. He has fought Wolverine, Captain America, the Thunderbolts, which he was part of, and of course Daredevil. And why do I say of course? Because he's part of the second season of the Daredevil TV show and he's the main antagonist. I think there's another one, but he's one of the antagonists. Yes. Next one, Captain America and Bucky Barnes. Just like a bunch of the other ones, they started as master and student in the comics. And in the movie, they were just really, really good friends. They fought the Nazis together, they were matching colors, they were like the Batman and Robin of the Marvel comics. But they also died together. And why do I say die? Because neither Captain America or Bucky died. Captain America got frozen and Bucky just got captured and got brainwashed and become the Winter Soldier. And that's when they fought. They fought each other because he was a bad guy. He was an assassin. And he didn't know what he was doing, but he was a bad guy. And Captain America tried to remind him who he was. And at the end, he did. He became a good guy again, even taking the Captain America mantle when Captain America died again. So, next one. Batman and Jason Todd. Yes, Batman has a lot of frenemies. A lot of people who he fight, and then he became friends, or who he became friends, and then he fight. He's just that kind of guy. Jason Todd was the second Robin, the first one to take the mantle after the first one. Yeah, that makes sense. Also, he was the first Robin to die, and Batman never got over it. For years, he didn't want help from anyone. But the bad thing is when he returned, because he got resurrected by the Lazarus Speed, and he became Red Hood. And why did he attack Batman? Because he was angry that he didn't avenge his death, killing the Joker. It kind of makes sense if you think about it. But he was so angry that he developed this big plan to take over Gotham's crime. They fought and then they made up. Red Hood became part of the Bat family, even wearing the Bat logo in red. He's kind of the more violent one of the family right now. He's kind of like a mercenary, but also a good guy. So yes, these were my favorite rivalries in comics. If you have another one that I missed, Leave it in the comments. Tell me what do you think about the one that I said. Which one do you think that I miss? And which one do you think it should be a movie? Also, if you like the video, please leave a like. Like I said, leave a comment and subscribe. Share with your friends. We will be friends. As always, bye.